Okay, so I think what's going on here, as I said before, these bars are bent because of the heel has been bent forward. The bar here has also been uh, bent up like this. And this is why I'm try having a hard time finding the end of the bar. Now the bars are, as you can see from the inner foot, they are triangular shaped right here. Okay, and um, so that, this is bar right, right in here, right here, from here up to here to here. That's as far as your bars go forward, okay? Um, so right to there, but if this, because it's at an angle up that way, if it was, if this bend was to come out of the bar wall here, and this was to straighten up in here, my bar would end about here. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go deeper into the foot right here to see if I can find the white line of this bar right here um, because I feel that because this bar has been up like that that it's actually, this is part of an overgrown part right here. So that's what I'm going to do. So. The way I would do that, and since we're dissecting the bar anyway, I'm going to come in and take off some more wall right here. Now I know the shape of my bar is triangular. So anything that isn't triangular here it would not be correct. And this bar also is distorted because, uh, as I say, the heel's bent up and that bent the bar up and so I'm just guessing that my white line is way down in here and uh, by George I'm right okay see I went further down into here look at how my white line is starting to show up look at it how it's right up in here see I couldn't find it down in here why not because the bar, because the heel's bending forward, I've pushed the bar wall here up that way. And so, you know, according to how structures and things connected together work, um, it also bent the white line up into there. All right, this is so awesome. Okay, so I'm gonna take some more of that bar wall out and find that white line that's way up in there. Aha. Man, that thing is really curving up there. Oh man, this is so interesting, folks. See, you're right in on the discovery with me. I was right, the bar wall is bent up. And I'm finding the white line clear up here. Look at that. Isn't that fabulous? See, this is what happens. You start understanding these structures. You know, you can guess if your heel's bent forward, it could very well be that it's pushed the bar up that way. And so you're looking for that yellow line. You can't find it. It's because it's been shoved further up into the foot right there. This is awesome. I might never have found this on him alive. Because, you know, I'm kind of doing some... Um, you're with me here on real-time learning about this bar here. Well, this is just, like, awesome. See, if I'd have kept digging over here, I wouldn't have found it, would I? Now, structurally, if the foot was correct, the bar should... This bar line that's right here should be right about there. But it's not because the heel has been bent forward, which has in turn bent the bar wall up that way including this white line here shoving it up higher into the foot so this is just fabulous <clears throat> all right how cool is that and see by finding this bar also and being able to define it I have a much better chance that I will uh, take the right things off of the heel so that the heel will, you know, come out like that and straighten up. 
and then this ledge won't be digging up into the bottom of the horse's foot. Say. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to come in here and we're going to find the end of that bar. <coughs> Yeah, I'm gonna come down it like so down the wall. This is hard. Huh, you wouldn't think a bar'd be clear up like that, now would you? Would you? You see it now? It goes almost straight over into the foot simply because the bar is bent upwards. See? Yeah. Look at that. That's what I mean by find and define. And because of the distortion, a lot of times they're hard to find. Where you think they'd be, they're not. But if you get a handle on, you know, how... Uh, Get a handle on structural engineering, okay? Okay, when I push here, that's going to move there, you know? When I push here, that's going to move there. That's all we're dealing with here. Huh, I never would have guessed that bar would be over there like that, almost straight over simply because the heel has been pushed forward and that has pushed the bar up like that or the collateral group. This is, see this in here? That's the insides of your collateral groove right there. You realize that if you got your heels right and then you found this bar, it might help straighten the whole heel out quite a bit because then you put the weight on here, it's not all glued together with a bunch of excess bar and sole filling up this whole air. Well, okay. We have something to compare it with, the other side of the foot. Look at that. Look how full that is there. Okay, that's just like gluing that all together right there. Once you get all this out and find and define your bar, that's going to give a chance of the weight of that horse to push down on this and straighten this all out here. So they ain't got this big ledge pushing up into his foot. Okay. Well, we're not done yet. We're going to define that baby a little more. Now we know where to come down on the bar. Wish I could get a better picture of this for you. Okay, see there? That bar's going straight into his foot like that. I'm seeing the white line all right in here. This is fascinating. Okay, so I'm going to come under here. Tell you one thing, this heel is getting a lot more flexible. I can feel it already. Look at that. Look at how that bar goes in there. Almost, it, it, you know, it should be triangular here, like so. It should be laying like that. Okay, but look at how it goes straight into the foot. Simply because the heel's been up, shoved up the bar right here, and just bent it in. Tell you what, you know, like I said, if this horse wouldn't have died, I don't know if I'd ever come to understand this quite you know I just don't know well I think eventually the bar would have got defined because as I kept clearing this out and him walking on this it would have pushed this down and straightened this out a little bit to where it would have been more over like that okay 